Hey y'all, this presentation is going to be about fractions, decimals, and percentages. So if you're around 5th to 6th grade, this is a good presentation for you. Okay, so in this presentation, you're going to learn about just the basics of fractions, decimals, and percents, converting from one to the other, and for fun, you're going to learn a little bit about baseball. So first of all, what is converting? Converting is changing from one thing to another, and in math this usually means converting between fractions, decimals, and percentages. Uh, one reason this is super helpful to learn now is because when you get harder fractions or decimals, it can be helpful to learn how to convert them to a different form of the number, just to make your problem a little bit easier. So here's our first example. This is Rick. He's a baseball player. So if we say that yesterday Rick got six hits on the 20 balls that were pitched to him, how would we show Rick's hit balls versus his missed balls as a fraction? So let's break it out. Um, our fraction is always going to be part over whole. So Rick's fraction is six, which is part. It's the amount of balls he hit over the total amount of balls pitched to him, which is the whole. If we simplify by dividing both of these by 2, we get 3 over 10. So now that we have that fraction, we can figure out Rick's batting average. And a batting average is a super common statistic you're going to see in baseball. Whenever you see a player's batting average, that means that that's the amount of balls a pitcher is most likely to hit if you pitch them 10. So how do you do it? All you have to do is divide the top, the numerator, by the bottom, the denominator. So 3 out of 10 becomes 3 divided by 10, and that equals 0 0.300. Bagging averages are always three decimal places, even if two of those are just zeros. So just for fun, let's make this decimal into a percentage. So all you have to do is super easy is move your decimal point over two spots to the right and you get your percentage and for us this is 30 percent remember going from a decimal to a percent always move to the right here's some more practice um here's some of my favorite players and their bad averages and we're going to try and find the percents and decimals of their averages so first we have jose altuve he's the astros second baseman and his batting average as of last season is 0 0.298. And we have Hinjin Ryu. He's a Dodgers pitcher. And his batting average is 0 0.178. So let's see how we do it. For Jose Altuve, we have 0 0.298. And for percentage, remember, we have to move our decimal point two spots to the right. And we get... 29.8%. And for a fraction, just remember that percentage is always out of 100. So if we have 29.8 out of 100, uh, then we can simplify that to 2.98 out of 10 by dividing both numbers by 10. And second, we have Hyunjin Ryu, 1, 0 0.178. And again, move the decimal point two spots to the right, and we get 17.8. And then fraction, same thing, 17.8 over 100. Simplify that to 1.78 over 10. And our bonus question is, how many pitches would these players hit if you threw them 10? So from Jose Altuve, we can see that's, if we round up, it's about 3 out of 10. So if you just threw him 10 pitches, he'd probably hit around three of them. For Hanjin Ryu, we can round up to two, so that's two out of ten. So if you threw him ten balls, he probably hit around two of them. All right, here's some practice problems. You don't have to do them, but they're really good if you just want to make sure that you know them. So if you're pitched to 30 times and you hit nine of the balls, what is your batting average? Let's see. And the answer is 0 0.300. Um, I'm gonna have the, a slide showing the work after all of these, so don't worry if you don't, if you got something different. Uh, second problem, 
On Monday, you hit two balls out of four pitches. On Wednesday, you hit three out of ten. On Saturday, you're pitched to 15 times and you hit three of them. What is your batting average for the whole week? And our answer is 0 0.333. And our last question. If your batting average is 0 0.244, about how many balls will you hit if someone pitches you 10? And our answer is about two. So here's the work. So first problem, our fraction is part over whole again, and it's nine over 30. We can simplify this to three over 10. Um, so convert to a decimal, divide the numer numerator by the denominator, and you get 0 0.3. So your value average is 0 0.300. And for the second problem, first we're gonna find out how many balls were pitched to you in total throughout the week. So we add up five plus 10 plus 15, and that equals 30. And then how many balls did you hit in total throughout the week? And that's four plus three plus three, which is 10. And our final fraction is 10 over 30. And we just divide that. So 10 divided by 30 is 0 0.3 repeating, which means that your bag average is just gonna round it's around 0 0.333. And then our last problem, first change the decimal into a percent. So we have 0 0.244, move it two spots to the right, and it's 24.4%. So percentages are always out of 100. So 24.4% equals 24.4 out of 100. So if we simplify this, it's 2.44 out of 10. Rounding, this means that for every 10 pitches, you're probably going to hit around two of them. So if you want to learn more, um, first thing you can do is try it yourself. Go out and play some baseball or catch to come up with your own practice problems. And practice working with real world numbers that will come from you just playing it yourself. Second, you can watch some baseball. ESPN is still showing Korean baseball, so you can pick a player and use their pattern averages and practice finding the percentage and the fraction from those averages. And last way is you could use some other examples. Fractions, decimals, and percentages are used super common in like real world. So you can ask your parents, show you some examples of where they see fractions and percents and decimals in their lives. And I'll give you a hint, it's most likely going to be about money. And here's some extra practice. Um, you can click each link for a worksheet about the subject. And about me. My name is Nicole Wittering. I'm a rising sophomore in Houston, Texas. I love baseball, especially the Astros. They're my favorite team. And thanks for watching. Here are my sources. I really hope y'all learned from this. Thank you.